Hi there, my name's Amo, and in this video I'm going to show you how to crop down an application capture down to just a portion of that application. So let's take a look at how to do it. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to add the app screen capture source, and by default it is capturing my other monitor, which you can't see, but it's capturing basically my other monitor. If I drag and drop that in here, this is the contents of my other monitor. It's just like a full screen window that's um, on a YouTube page here that's showing a video. So what we want to do is we want to crop down this source to just this video. And so let's see how to do that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hover my mouse over app screen capture, the source here, and I'm going to hit this plus button. And then I'm going to choose crop and filter from the menu that appears. So now inside this UI, you'll see that there are these green uh, handles here. We can use these handles to basically resize them so that only the video is uh, selected here is, is is shown that means we've cropped out all the other stuff of that window such that when we go back here we are we have now two sources we have our original app screen capture and we have our cropped one so I'm gonna delete our um, on the canvas the original source since Polypop maintains both sources the original and the crop so since we don't want the original here I'm gonna remove that and now I'm gonna just drag and drop in our cropped version and there you go we have it reduced just down to the sub portion of that screen. Um, and the nice thing about it is that now we can also use it, for instance, if we load a 3D object here that requires a texture and make this a little bit bigger. We can use that uh, crop and filter version just to nicely map 3D objects as well, which just that. So it's, um, it's a nice way to kind of reduce a larger image down to just a portion that you're actually interested in. And this works with all image sources, including baked videos, webcams, and images as well. So um, very useful. Um, hopefully that was, uh, that was helpful, and I will see you next time.